this is part three and this is pattern number seven and pattern number seven is what I call is base chord chord pattern okay and this is a beautiful beautiful pattern used by many classical composers like Beethoven um, especially Chopin and uh, many others so let me show you how to play this chord I'm sorry bass chord chord pattern so again let's take the chord C but what we are going to do is we are going to go one octave lower to the low C and just play once and then come over to the C chord and play twice Be careful and make sure that you do use sustain pedal because if I don't use a sustain pedal this is how it will sound so there is a kind of a break between the bass and the chord uh, but with the pedal which is a sustain pedal this is how it will sound Every time you change the chord, release the pedal and press it again. So let's do a small exercise with these, with these three chords, uh, C, F and G. So let's do with C, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, go to F, just play the F bass note and come and play the root position of F chord. Do the same thing with G. And let's put it in the song. So on, all right. This is called bass chord chord. So bass chord chord. Uh, let's say if the song was in the time signature of four four, then you would do something like this: one, two, three, four. So that's pattern number seven.